Maria Tech. Jesus Maria Tech. Hi everybody, I'm Peter from Offroad Electric and today is another day when we will work on Tatra. Yesterday we took our uh, we took we took all of the metal from the bed. I loaded it up on the trailer. Today we are going to scrap it to get some money because obviously you don't donate enough on our Patreon yet. <laughs> <coughs> and then we'll continue on this. here <clears throat> we'll see if they let us film film it yeah. okay so we got some money back from the scrap uh, scrap metal and now what else we need? Uh, I have to take off the Cobra over there, which is intake, which is intake uh, over the cab. It's too high, so I will not get through to my shop through the through the doorway. Plus, uh, we also have to clean up the cab because there is so much mess. As you can see, it's a. Uh, it's a paradise over here. Mess everywhere. <laughs> Can't believe it. We, I guess I will just throw it away. Or <laughs> it's disgusting. <Ugh. laughs> and that smell. <laughs> These are looks like military socks with, with high quality from a high quality material. <laughs> you can send me text and I can send it to you if you want. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is for <laughs> this is for for uh, for later times. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's disgusting, I can't believe. Uh, can't imagine a driver who drives this <laughs> who drove this vehicle. I'm not going to wash my clothes, I'm going to burn it. 
after this. Pilsner, the best beer in the world. Actually, <laughs> okay, it's golden peasant actually. <laughs> it was so dirty. <laughs> I thought it's Pilsner, okay. Maybe the second best beer in the world. Ah, grinding wheel, super, I can use something. This is just one big trash can over here. Can you imagine that you drive a truck like this? Do you remember these? The old tacos from 2000 years ago. Wow, <laughs> quality Slovakian knife. <laughs> Look at that. Ah. Ah. So we are done with that for now. I am definitely going to wash my hands now. So next step is uh, we are going to remove this cobra. It, it's intake, air intake, which is above the cab about one foot above the cab so we need to get as slow as possible so it needs to go intake is out of course I am going to put some bucket over here we don't need the water into in, uh, to get into intake we are going to cut this bed into pieces so we'll cut off the ends on the left and on the right and then we'll cut this floor bed in three pieces and I will cut the sheet metal from the top then we will flip it out of the truck let it drop on the ground and then I will cut the cross beams from another side. One more left. Yeah, if I had a plasma cutter, that would be different life, huh? Well, it's so rusty, it will be actually a much easier job than I thought. I'm glad, first time in my life, I'm glad that something is rusty.
No second side, it should go pretty easily uh, disconnected from the main bed. We are done with easy stuff. Now the real game is coming. it's in the right spots and we'll have fun a couple of hours extra with cutting can wait <laughs> really quick okay now now is the time to remove the bed <coughs> we are going to use these pivot points and these points are used for when uh, they unload the, the stuff from the bed the cargo from the bed <coughs> so we are going to lift that second side up uh, upwards with the hydraulic jack a little bit as much as we can actually then we will hook that side of the bed with the winch of my Land Rover 
<coughs> and we will flip this bed this way so it will land on this top side and will land on the ground with this top side Really bad feeling about this. Probably I shouldn't be winching anything from this position. Finally, <laughs> and I'm done for today. Trust me, I have enough. See you next time. <laughs>